Elliot Rogers. <laughs> Elliot Rogers. All right, so I'm I'm a bit late on this one. Not that I didn't know about this story from before, but I was about to skip it. I really was. I was about to just skip it. But then I thought, you know what? Let me say something because this is actually going to be a very good lesson for other kids, other men his age, okay? And I say men his age as, as, as though I'm some old dude, but I don't care. Elliot Rogers, all right. Um, Where do I start with him? I, I, first of all, the room's a mess. I'm going to be cleaning when I get back. And where am I getting back from? You'll find out in a second, but... So this Elliot Rogers kid in Kipa, he is a perfect example of why, I mean, even though I don't subscribe to any specific labels here and there, okay, he is a perfect example of why men, uh, let me just pick one because, you know, let me just pick one, go their own way, he's a perfect example of why men need to do that. I'm, I gotta ask why he cared so much. Well, okay, let's, let's, let's just work on why. Let's just go down the line. Number one, this kid was rich. This kid had money. This kid had elevated social status. I mean, hell, he wasn't re really well known. His dad was well known, I guess, doing some, uh, doing the Hunger Games or whatever the hell. Uh, he was the director or whatever the hell he was. So his dad was well known as. But he himself was maybe not as well known. I I never heard of him. Uh, but he had money. He had. You heard him. That right there should have been enough. It really should have. Cause I think we all know plenty of girls, hot ass girls that go out with dudes that are like complete rapist assholes. Okay. And yet they got money, so they got hot ass girls. So the money should have been enough. He, he had everything there laid out for him on a silver platter. I don't know how he fucked it up. Okay? Because me, I am a bro. Well, in this country, I'm broke. Back home, I have stuff. I have wealth. I have a bit of money waiting on me in the form of different, different things. Properties and whatnot, thanks to my grandpa. But here, I am broke as fuck. I'm driving the ultimate beater in my 01 Kia. Okay, that Optimus. Um, and I, I am, I am. Let's just say I have to take a look at my money. Okay, I'm not one of these people like him who doesn't have to do that. And yet, if it wasn't for the fact that I might get sued, I would sit there and list out all of the girls. I have them in my phone. Just list out all of the girls that I've ever had sex with. Most of them have been from 21 till now. Okay. I can get ass, okay? I mean, I'm not really doing anything now, but I can get ass, that's the point. And I am broke as fuck. Um, so him, I don't know what, I really don't. Now, the one thing that I will say that is, a good, the only thing that I will applaud him for is that he didn't take the drug, okay? He, they tried to get him help, but apparently his mom tried to get him help. They tried to string him up on drugs. Thank you, Elliot, for not taking the drugs. This kid wanted some ass. He wanted some fucking pussy. Natural, biological thing. He just wanted some ass. That's it. If he had gotten some ass, he would have been fine. Just fine. Okay? Just fine. He did not need drugs. He needed fucking pussy. Okay? That's it. Now... What well, most would probably be like, dude, you have money. Why the fuck are you even? I mean, you see how us non-rich guys like you have our grievances with the average mentality of the Western woman. Why the hell didn't you ask? Take yourself on them private jets you were talking about. Go over to some other country. Present the fact that you're an American. Present the fact that you got the monies. You got it. You're American and you got the monies. And get all the ass you want. I mean, hell, old ass dudes go to Thailand. Okay, I don't really want to degrade any country or put anyone down, but let's just be honest here. Old ass dudes go to Thailand and Cambodia and pick up all of these, God forbid, underage, but young ass girls, okay, 60, 70 year old dudes, 
got these 16, 17, 18 year old Thai girls look uh, look better than American girls in, in some cases. What was wrong with, why couldn't you have done that? Huh? Why could you not have done that? Just You just wanted to ask. Now, yes, I understand. I personally understand this. You would rather know that, hey, I was able to get ass because she wanted my dick. She wanted to fuck me. Okay, yes, I understand that. I don't advocate paying for ass. Me, I, I am sorry. I don't pay for stuff that people that other people have gotten for free, especially if I'm not the first in line. I can understand if you're like some short, thick, thick. I mean, I, I don't mean fat, but I mean like muscular, thick, like eighteen year old a, Asian girl virgin or something. That I could understand. Okay, maybe you want the first guy to pay. Okay, fine, whatever. But if I'm like sloppy one trillion, see. I don't know. Not paying, so I can understand what he's saying. He, you know, he wants the girls to come to him because of him, not because he had to throw some hundreds at them. Yes, okay, it's the money that got put in. Not, not you. I understand. Fine, but you know, in this situation, it's just like, yo, fuck it. I just need to get this one off. He, he was a virgin, from what I understand. Yo, I just need to blast this one off. Fuck it. Fuck the love and on in today's day and age. That waiting for love bullshit is, is, is just that bullshit. I just need to get this one off. After that, we can work on talking about just just pay, man. Just just or his parents, mom. Instead of trying to send him string him up on drugs, you should have just paid some girl to like him, to be his girlfriend for about a month, fuck him a few times, and be like, okay, well I'm moving away now, so we gotta do, and he be none the wiser. That could have saved all of this. There is so many ways that this thing could have been handled. It's fucking ridiculous. Now, I'm not going to get into all the other stuff that he had. The, the fact that he looked androgynous. Well, not, not, not completely androgynous, but let's just say he could have looked a bit more on the masculine side. I'm sorry, mm -hmm. but, eh. You know, the whole dainty... Uh, like female love novels, kind of closet twink type shit. Nah, that w w women say they want that. That's all on they don't. Okay. Um. He could have. He could have looked a bit more rough. You know, looked like he could have taken a hit or two. Okay, fine. Um. He could have. I don't know. I don't. I don't get where he went wrong. Where the hell did he go wrong? Every single thing, whatever racist, sexist, whatever the hell he had, is only because he couldn't get pussy. That was it. And all that needed to happen was either he go and pay for that shit, go out of the country, do whatever the hell you want to do, or your parents, they, they could have paid. I don't understand. I don't get what happened. Put any other dude me or anybody watching here in his situation where he had the money, he had the residue of societal status from his parents or whatever the hell and and whatever they did. The cars, the nice clothes, the glasses according to him. Put any one of us in that situation, man. You wouldn't be able to tell us. We tell you. I don't even get how he fucked that up. I really don't. But, I don't know. I don't know. I, I really don't understand. But, he, he could have done that. Now, I can't believe how fast 10 minutes goes by. Um, To any other guys out there his age that are fucking frustrated, they're trying everything, they're doing everything, and it's not. First of all, if you have money, go get, go pay for that shit, okay? You can go pay. Shit. Shit. You have money, you can do whatever the fuck you want. Everybody knows this. Hell, go, you want to take a risk and go with an underage girl, go find a 14, 15, 16 year old girl, pay her to shut the fuck up, just take this dick, let her, let you bust in her or something, and then pay her off to shut the hell up. Money can do that. And I think we all know that. So if you have money, there's no excuse. For the rest of you, let's say you don't have money, you're in his situation, but you don't have money, you don't have the political well, not political, but you don't have the societal clout. 
men going your own way. Um, people like to associate me with that. That's fine. Okay. I, I again, I do not have any labels. I might do stuff that seem to put me in one camp or another, but I don't really have the labels. You need to go your own way, man. I'm sorry that this whole thing of gauging how, 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 how well you, how much of a man you are by how much pussy you've gotten. I'm one to talk because I've gotten more pussy than most guys get in their life. So I probably am going to be a fucking hypocrite to say this. But the thing is, I am not controlled by it. Yes, I get ass. Okay, but I am not controlled by it. You know, so it... I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know what to tell you guys. Um, You need to go do your own stuff. What makes women so damn special that you just got to have the pussy, man? You say, oh my god, I just got to get a girl. No. First of all, in today's day and age, with the way society and just the way society as in the modus operandi of the world is set up, of culture, well, not culture, but society in the world is set up, especially the Western world, nobody should be having any kind of relationship. They should not be getting married, obviously. They should not be having any kind of relationship. They should really only be doing friends with benefits, all right? I mean, I I think I've gone through this before, but if not, I can make another video on this of what men and women really need each other for. The only thing that they should be doing is sex. That's it. Go find your emotional, physical, whatever the hell else connection somewhere else. Just come to each other when you want sex, and that's it. Sounds bad, but you know what? Again, if you look at the day and age and the world and the country, well, not even the country, but the world and the Western society that we live in. So, again, you know, if, if, if it's just sex you want, just go get the sex, and that's it. Um, but apart from that, just do your own stuff. Where am I going today? I, I, from the beginning of this video, I said, you all will find out where I'm going. Guess where I'm going? The same place I've been going three days a week for, what, over a year and a half now? I'm about to take my ass to the gym. Huh? Huh? To the gym. Okay, well, it's, it's kind of bad angle. I'm taking my ass to the gym. About to go lift me some heavy ass weights. You saw my video back, some videos back. My first... 600 pound deadlift attempt successful you don't get that by sweating over women you don't get that you don't get to be able to do that by chasing after pussy okay i'm sorry you don't you get to that by well obviously the literal stuff that you need to do the whole training and eating right and all that shit you know it took me a year and a half to be able to do that obviously sorry but it also comes by putting women on the back fucking burner they're lucky they make my list of 100 things to do Yes, I want some pussy. Okay, fine. Where are the women? Don't eat pussy anymore? Okay, women can leave me the fuck alone. Go away and don't bother me until I want some more pussy out of you. Done. Go about my own life. Go do what I need to do. Do whatever. Right now, I'm going to the gym. Um, got the passport sent off. I just did that yesterday. Finally got that thing after the run around. Got, got sent off of my Jamaican passport. So when I get that, I will now be free to go about wherever I want to go, in and out of the country, okay, four to six weeks, they mail it off this coming Wednesday, all right, four to six weeks from this coming Wednesday, going about my own life, doing my own stuff, not sitting there and giving a shit about how much pussy that I am getting or not getting, it, I don't know, you need to go find your own stuff, even if it's fucking video games, you know what, fine, the amount of girls that I see here getting up in arms because a lot of these dudes are paying more attention to video games than them, they have their own stuff doing. They have their own thing doing. Okay, they're not sitting here basing their whole manhood or their whole self-worth based off women and the approval of women. Because the moment you do that, hey, women got you by the fucking balls. They have you jumped up through flaming, jagged, rusty hoops, and they get to take it away at will and give it to you at will. You're a man if you do this. You're not a man if you don't do that. Real men, real men, real men. Do this or don't do this. I'm going to say it one more time. The only thing 
that men should meet women for this and my part of that. They need to just go their own separate ways. Men can go back to Mars, women can go back to Venus, and when they want to bang each other out, they come to Earth. Why? Elliot Rogers and guys like him, you just need to get some ass. That's it. You don't need to be in any fucking relationship. I, I, you were sitting there crying about how girls don't want You don't need to want them. Just fuck them. That's it. You don't need to be in a fucking relationship for that. Just fuck them. That's it. And he should not have been chasing that type of relationship, okay? You should have just been looking for ass. You had the money. You should have just been paying for some ass just to get that one out of the way if need be. Sorry, that has to be the way, you know I mean? Some of us can just get ass by talking, you know, by, by or, or just by being us. That didn't work for him. Throw money at it. Money is the answer to all things. Almost all things. Go do your own stuff. He did all this shit chasing after women, trying to appeal to women. And on the surface, they probably did like it. I'm, I'm, I'm not surprised if some women pretended to like him just to get some money out of him. Gave him no arse. Gave him no ass at all. And he's a bit salty about that as well. In fact, anybody who says that didn't happen, they're lying. I, I, can, I can pretty much guarantee you left and right not that's also part of what happened. Not only was he not getting any ass, but the girls also got money up out of him without him getting any pussy up out of it. Okay, so that's 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 the other thing. I, it's just you need to go do your own stuff. Me, I have the gym doing. I have well future plans involving international business. I call it international business, just business in Jamaica, business in some other place. It's fine. I have my own stuff that I'm scheming, that I'm planning, plotting. Okay. To be about my own damn life and not have to sit here more about women. And doing that, you'll be surprised at how many women damn near force you to take the ass. They're, 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 they're pretty much rape you. Like, like uh, yo, you're going to take this pussy whether you want it or not. You'd be surprised how many men, how many dudes probably fuck a lot more girls than they actually want to because those girls forced the pussy on them. Okay, and they couldn't say no. Why? Because they went and did their own thing. They didn't worry about women. They didn't sit here and base their self-worth off how much women they have around them. And that is the, what this poor Elliot Rogers kid, as racist as he was, because I, I, I know the whole entire thing about this Elliot Rogers kid. I just didn't get into it because it's completely relevant, because all of that could have been easily stopped if he had just gotten some ass from anybody. Black, white, Asian, Spanish, Middle Eastern, Martian, Alpha Centaurian, whatever. Could have just gotten some ass and he would have been just fine. All that racism and all that would have just been... And, 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 and superiority complex, all of that would have been just completely locked down if he had just been able to bust his nut balls deep in some girl's pussy, maybe even her ass, I don't know. It, guys, you've got to, guys, I'm surprised Elliot actually wasn't a racist. I'm surprised he actually didn't go, well, that's because probably the girls could have probably kicked his ass. I mean, again, as thin and frail and effeminate as he was, <laughs> he probably got beat the fuck up by thin, dainty, effeminate girls all the damn time. So that's probably why he wasn't doing it. But I'm surprised he didn't just haul off and just say, you know what, I'm taking this pussy. There you go, feminist. If anybody was, a, was to be a rapist, it would be him, and he didn't. So, yeah, all men are rapists. Okay. Um, but... Like I'm saying, to wrap this up, guys, you need, especially younger guys, yes, I know the girls are going to, the girls are dressed the way they're dressed, it's, the stuff that they're wearing is designed to keep you in a constant state of sexual arousal, you're supposed to try to get it or else you're demonized as being gay, even though there's supposedly nothing wrong with that, I've been meaning to get on you gay people. All you gay guys, I've been, well, not get on you, but tell you all a bit of warning about these straight women and, and all that. But I'll do that in another video. Really got to warn these guys about that. Um, but yeah, there's supposedly nothing wrong with being gay, but if you don't sit there and act thirsty and desperate and, 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 and act like you're want the pussy, then you're gay. Okay, they, they keep it as a fact. I understand. Fine. Okay? Fuck them. Well, yeah. Fuck them, but 
Fuck them. Let's just okay. Who the hell cares? So what? Fuck them. Go still go do your own stuff and watch how much other ass that you're not even realizing is nearby comes and basically like shoves that pussy down your throat or something. Okay? You don't need to give a shit about these women. You don't. You don't need to chase them. You don't need to give a shit about them. They don't give a shit about you. Trust me. They are in it for their own self-interest. Do your own stuff. I have my own stuff doing. Jim is one of them, as you clearly see. Go look at my old videos and you'll see that I am not in the shape that I am in now. And even now, I'm not looking all that great, although I certainly as hell look better than before. I did my own stuff. If I was sitting there chasing after ass, I wouldn't be able to deadlift 600 pounds. You know, I wouldn't be able to squat like, what, one and a half times my body weight or something for fucking reps. For, for like five by five. I, I wouldn't be able to do that. Do your own stuff, man. Ignore women, act like they don't exist, and you'd be amazed at how many men you actually still do get. Anyway, that's it. Um, I hope the next Elliot Rogers uh, gets gets a hold of this video and uh, before he does anything stupid. I could, I mean, hell, I could go into the women and 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 and, and their whole abuse of sexual power and all that shit, but I won't in this video. Not in this video. Not in another video. Anyway, later.